just like, like and so like this like it's going to be all touch screen now. It's going to be this like new software. Hey yo, we're back at kbeach.org global news radio. You're listening to Sex <laughs> at the Beach Cross <laughs> at kbeach www.kbeach.org. See, I tried. Forgive him. He's trying. I'm trying. We had a we had an email from Glenn who's the big homie here down at K Beach. He just like a uh, Give us some props, so you, you should definitely call us up and be here listening to. Uh, so we got we got Dre in the mic, we got Christine, Christine. we got Mike on the mic, and we got <laughs> Mike <laughs> on the mic, <laughs> and we got Allison just hiding in the corner doing her little producer thing, giving us pointers. So yo, um, we were talking about before uh, public sex. Well, we were first we, we started at PDAs, then we got to public sex. So um, so which what about like sex in public with people watching? Like, uh, I, guess, I guess it's called exhibitionism. Oh, I guess it's ex- exhibitionism, yeah. How is that? What do you guys think about that then? Um, is that like. That kind of happened on, to us on accident one time. Like, Whoa. somebody actually caught us. Like, oh. But so, did, did you keep going like, or was it like. Or? Uh, no, because like we, we were kind of like. Wait, which time is this? The butcher shop. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh this is a story. You were doing it in a butcher shop? <laughs> this is a story. Does that not freak you out? Okay, so I don't, I don't work for this particular... Su- I, mean, uh, I know you want meat. <laughs> I don't work for this particular grocery store anymore, so I have no problem saying this story. Um, okay. Okay, so... They, uh... I, I did a lot of things, and one day they needed me to help out in the meat department, and uh, they have this butcher's freezer. And, uh, you know, Bree knew that I was, I was miserable there, smelling like fish, and she just wanted to help me out on, my, on her break. So she came, she uh, she came in to the to the meat locker, and it's pretty much <laughs> oh the freezer room. The freezer room. Yeah, yeah, I used to work at Round Table, so we had like a, a free I forget what the walk-in. We called it the walk-in. Yeah, exactly, something like that. Freezer room, yeah. Yeah, I mean it's not quite like Rocky or anything with the bovine hanging down, but it's still nasty. pretty meaty and nasty. nasty. And, uh, <laughs> so anyway, she, I have a, uh, <laughs> I have the full gear on, and you know we start. Start getting in and kissing and all that stuff, and she she goes down on me, and it's starting to feel, it's starting to feel good. And right at, right at that I moment, so. we hear we hear this this man, and he's like, I, but he didn't open the door yet. He just kind of is looking in through this little window. All he can see basically is me, and he can see maybe the back of her head, but he doesn't know what's actually going on, right? I don't think oh. it's on my head either. I don't. Yeah, maybe not. And uh, oh, he, and he he goes and he says this before he opens the door. He goes, Oh, I caught you! I caught you! <laughs> But see, he was, he was being, like, facetious. He was kidding. And uh, he opens the door, oh. and, then, and, then, <laughs> and then he sees... Oh, my God, like, I really caught you. <laughs> and then he sees uh, my phallus. <laughs> and, um, yeah. And then he, he realizes, yes, that he really had caught us. And he freaks out and starts, like, walking away really, really fast. And it turns out, thank God, it was my boss. Uh, it was a customer, actually. Um, wow. looking for Wait, it was the boss or it was no, the customer? Customer. Looking for, sir, like, help. Finding a uh, meatloaf, actually. No, <laughs> you, oh, you found the meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> you found it. That's right. And <laughs> so she didn't know what to do, so she freaked out and just she actually got locked in the meat freezer. I know. <gasps> I like ran out with the, the meat freezer door and like locked, and I was like, oh no! Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. So how did the customer get to the meat? Freezer? Because he wasn't even supposed to go back there. He just like yeah, saw. I, yeah, I'm like I was. Yeah, gonna be going so it's all the customer's fault. He's not supposed <laughs> to be back there. So I I try to chase him down. So I'm trying to get my stuff together, trying to zip up and everything, but I just couldn't quite do it. And I didn't want him to go tell my manager. So what I do is I drape over my big red apron, over. Um, Free balling? I don't know. Sure. <laughs> <There's Italian. laughs> and uh, and chase after him. And I, I meet him in the frozen section. And I'm just like, sir, you know what? I'm so sorry. Like I know how inappropriate. <laughs> I and like how you apologize. That is. I mean, he does. I, wow. I was begging him for forgiveness, and he's like, look, man. And he had a bicycle mustache, and he looked like he'd been around the block. So he was like, look, man. I was young once too. I, I understand. But please, wow. can you tell me where the meatloaf is? <laughs> <laughs> Look, That's what I'll, he said. I'll keep, if you give me some free meat, I'll, I'll, I'll probably blackmail. Like, look, man, that two-ton steak there looks kind of good if it was free. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. I, I would have given him anything at that point. It was pretty pretty embarrassing. Wow. Oh, I, was, yeah. I was just scared because I thought it was the boss. I didn't know it was a customer. So I was like, oh, no, I'm going to get fired. And as I'm begging for him to you know, not make me lose my job, she's locked in the <laughs> freezer locked. That because so she hard. started freaking out. And, and like, couldn't I figure out the door. I had to read instructions on how to open the door. It says, and then the first thing it says, no, you are not locked in. Then <laughs> you know you are not locked in? <laughs> it actually yeah. says that. It says that. I am locked in. Ha ha, we were kidding. And then, and then it gives line. like instructions on how to open the door. So I was like reading it as I'm like all panicking to get back. And like, 
from like 10 minute break, which is long. Oh. Huh? Oh. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, so it wasn't the boss, so I was happy. All right, oh. so that's a good story. So, wow. But that that kind of didn't touch on us. I mean, you, so you guys got caught by accident. What about doing it and like getting not getting caught, but like oh, with the purpose that. of everybody watching you? Oh, like, I don't like, think I would do that. Like, it's not the whole point of doing it in public, in a sense, a public area. It's not so much in the eyes of public. It's the whole rush of. I could get caught, you know, like, you don't actually want to get caught because it's, like, embarrassing. Okay. So, but we, so we got a per person online here. You just want to push the limit, we you got, know? We got perfect song here who says, if you have a girl who does that hold on to her for the whole public sex thing, he says, that's, a, that's well, he, she, uh, I don't know your sex, so I apologize, but this person says that perfect song says that's a rush. And he's all for it. He oh, or she. I can't, okay, for, perfect song. Third. Let's see, let's see. Okay, so I'm bad That's at this. That's hella fun. That's what I think. And if a guy has so a hella fun, though. It sounds like he's a, that person's from the Bay Area. Oh. Or Washington. So anyway. He, he's, pretty, he's pretty much saying to hold on to your girl because... <laughs> no problem. Thanks, yeah. man. Girl. <laughs> That's good stuff. So, um, what do you say? So, but what if, so the whole in public people watching, you guys aren't into? No? Uh, uh, we might have uh, partaken in that maybe once. Yeah, but it was like, we had sex in one in front of one of his friends. And, like, his friend didn't know it, so I guess that was a rush for us. Like, his friend didn't know we were having sex in front of him. That makes uh, him... It was in a jacuzzi. The bubbles were on, so... Oh, uh, the friend, but see, to me, that's still, like, not really doing it for the public. Like, you're still trying to do it in secret. You're just doing it in a public place. Like, I've had, actually, sex many times um, with my ex in his dorm room while his roommate was sleeping. Ah. So... <laughs> You have to be really quiet and stuff, but it was a rush. It was like, you know, just, you could totally get caught right now. And yeah, that's exactly so why I want to do it, you know. Like, so, just like wake up and be but, like, can't you forever? Yeah, well, I would, actually, I'd probably just laugh it off and be like, oh, it's just like, I don't know, like he's getting a free show right now. Like, you know, like, <laughs> I, he should be happy. Like, he's a lucky boy. He should tip you or something. Yeah. See, I've done stuff like that where I've had my roommates in the room, and I know they're slightly awake. And he was that, actually, his roommate was probably awake. Like, uh, I really uh, doubt that he was, don't like, get me wrong, fully yeah, asleep. You were more like, likely making more than enough noise to wake him up. So. No, we were pretty quiet, but... Oh, so, but, yeah, um, so, what about, like, uh, sex tapes and that kind of thing? You guys... I've never done a sex tape. I've never done a sex tape. Yeah, oh, I, I, I either. But, I always, but what I would you feel about? I always had a about it. Like, I always, like, told myself, like, never make a sex tape because if you break up with a guy, like, or some... I'm not going to break up with him, but I'm just saying, like, if you break up with a guy, <laughs> so like, like, and they have a copy, they're going to, like, use it. It's not like, like oh, I'll give it wow. back to you. Then I give it back it's to you. It's a two-way story, people. isn't it? I mean... Yeah, but I would, like, probably just keep it for myself and maybe destroy it. But, like... We've done some sexy pictures. I don't know if that... <sighs> so you guys aren't... That's the line. Not video, though. Not no video. video. I... So straight to picture? No. no okay. <laughs> I think I'm sorry you let you down. No, I think I was always, like, curious about maybe making one. Like, I mean, I've never actually done it. But, like, to me, I'm, like, I kind of, make, I don't know, I would get kind of uncomfortable I just, with it. yeah, I would feel weird watching myself. On yeah. Just, I, think, I, I think that's what it is. I think it's just, like, like, I could totally watch him doing, like, a plastic doll or something. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. <laughs> That came out of left okay. field. <laughs> does, does that, that's, that's how she imagined you. She's like, I, she's like, has these these fantasies and dreams of you right. like with dolls, wow. not, not with her. Wow. <laughs> so she's like, just like, just that's why she, that's why she brought you here, so she could say that. She's wow. waiting for the opportunity. <laughs> like, ah, finally, I got my chance. <laughs> so uh, dolls, huh? I, I don't know. I mean, I mean, I, I just, I mean, I meant to say. <laughs> no, There's no going back on it. I mean, it is pretty intimidating, you know, like, unless you have the lighting right, you know, maybe a tripod, like, yeah, set up. Yeah, See, I'm like, all for it. Um, to I me, I don't know. I think, scared, it's like, I don't know, I just think one of the sexiest things is me and my girl being together and just seeing it, like... Watching yourself? Yeah. So how many movies have you made? <laughs> oh, yeah, Dre. Uh, What's the number now? I don't, like, well, Four, my little camera here does really good, does film, and I don't know, I just... Filming every now and not, and it's not like it's not like full on like three hour videos. It's just like you know little I want to say twenty minute clips, or forty five minute clips <laughs> is what I meant to say. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> but like, it's just like stuff like that, and right. I just find that like just cute, sexy, and like you know, 
Uh, okay, question. Do you keep it to yourself or well, do you put most it Most definitely on? not. <laughs> No, 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 no. There is a website um, oh, yeah, that's right. called You Porn. Yeah, I heard it's that. It's a spinoff of YouTube. There is a bunch of websites like yeah. that. I can actually. But this one, I think, is more. There's like this like, website that links you to a bunch of other adult websites. No, no, no. But see, this is different. It's not no, it's trying not to different. spam you with yeah. all these different websites that actually really harm your computers. I'd really be careful about that. But like You Porn is like, it's legit.